Hi everyone, this is Edward of China back again with Rome 2 Total War, the Divided Pyramid, the Asini Heart Campaign. Let's start again. Now we took Cenabum, but we are perilously close to the Romans. So there's a big risk there. It's basically Babracht. That's all that splits me from the Romans, and they are much stronger than me. And my budget, my budget isn't allowing me to make more soldiers. So it's a big problem. Great empires are not maintained by timidity. That is true. Weak leadership can definitely steer an empire wrong quite fast. Impressively fast. That and widespread corruption. It's just faults in the political system. The political system, the state machinery, the infrastructure. If you can't get that working properly, you're in trouble. Okay, so here we are. We have Cenabum, which is... Oh, they're making lead. What's lead for? It's for slingers, basically. It's not... Oh, yeah, and pipes. The Romans. The Romans know about the lead pipes. Okay, so... Nemeto Senna doesn't have a fleet. Oh, port. Lemonum doesn't have a port. Which means if I defeat the Averni fleet... Good rhyme. Um, I might be able to completely remove them from the, the sea as a theater of combat. So let me actually see if I can find them. Let's see, maybe... I'm, I'm just gonna search down the river, just in case. Okay, no, I don't see them. They gotta be a somewhere. I don't think they're gonna be a threat, but they're probably up here somewhere. If I wipe them out, then basically we've destroyed the last of any presence in the sea. Which is a good thing. It's a good place to start with. How are you guys doing? You guys, Oh yeah, okay. Two turns, one turn, one. Only one? Goodness. Oh, that's beautiful. What's up with Cinnabum's population? They're doing very well. Oh, it's all... Whoa. Okay, that's province. I want to say, frick, province 70,000 for a city. That would be crazy. Okay, so Wauli are very slowly being converted. Very slowly. Let's see, how's Eolio Bona doing? Because we are slowly infiltrating the system. Uh, first, we've got to get them happy. And then we're going to have to focus on other things. At least we've got a decent garrison. Mm. We got the cash. It'll help us with our cultural inf... Actually, wait. Wait a minute, plus 8, plus 8. Oh, I have to go all that way for the plus 12. Okay, we can hold off on that. Hold off. Hold off. Save the budget. Save the budget. We'll see what we can do beyond that. Okay. Okay, so... Look, you... There's not much left. But I don't want to make peace with you and then be at war with the Romans. Okay, fine. Fine, choose your things. The, my biggest problem is going to be when I, I make contact with Rome. I have to fight them and I don't, I don't think I have a chance on earth of holding off against them. My budget can barely even sustain two full uh, military units. One being my army and one being my fleet. How am I supposed to do more than that? Public order wise we can barely sustain these two provinces. They're barely happy. Freak, but this game makes it hard. Okay, so um, let's just see. Make sure nothing going on here. Look on here, you're 16. You still need to get work on that. You eight, please survive. Although I must say we have had less childhood fatalities recently, so that's at least a good thing. Bah! The end two's gone. It's terrible. Don't show, don't show. Enough of that. Okay, next turn. Okay, let's see. Fertilization of the soil. Did it? <laughs> uh huh? A Boracon to Mayor Dunedin. What the frick's going on up there? Why are you guys leaving? It's just the winter. There's some poor soldiers if they just leave because it's winter. Like you're in your houses. They're supposed to keep you from freaking wanting to leave. That's messed up. Okay, so we just got fertilization, which was this one. Uh, this one gives us some more money. We desperately need the more money. And that's gonna give us some fishing. Local markets. Okay, I think I might need to start looking back at my um, military again. Then my time. That's gonna be harsh. 
Plus one recruitment slots. Uh, it's not bad if I need it quickly. That's all just for smithing. Ah, uh, this one gives me a bit more of that. Gives me a raider's port. Hmm. I, 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 oh, wait a minute. It requires the copper resources. Is that all? So it doesn't need that. What was I going to turn this into again? This was a military. Oh, oh, silver mine, silver mine. Oh man, silver mine. Oh, that's, that's beautiful. I love the silver mine. Um, silver talent. It's going to give me so much money. It give me some people. Uh, I have to compare that. There's still one more build slot, so we can build a farm over there. Is this thing even making food? This place is losing food. That makes this decision a bit more difficult. But this doesn't take food, so that's at least one good thing. Silver mine, open pit mining enables the land to be easily milked of its resources. Oh, well, that's I don't really like it that much. Jewelry trade-offs gives me a lot of wealth, but. Let's see here. Minus four, minus two. Ah, there you go. 300, 180. Minus four, land recruitment cost. Minus two, but gives me a lot more people. Second class, foreigner. I don't like the foreigner population. They give us units, but not very reliable units. So, uh, that's, uh, oh, this is hard. It's either that or just don't do it at all. But we need the cash. I'll, I'll take it because we need the cash. And the unit recruitment if we want to keep this military juggernaut going, which we do. We, we need to, to scale up our cash if we have any dreams of fighting the Roman Empire. Because we can't feel that many armies. We just lose everything. Uh, so, let's see. Still haven't done that. Maybe I really should. There's just no point. I just don't see the point in doing it. This tree is just not useful enough for me. It's good. To, okay, I'm, this, these are fast. These are fast. I'll take these couple because they're gonna help me be faster. Heroxos, say at Chaturuski. That means something's happened over there. It looks like the Nervi are getting stronger. Golly, I was unhappy. Oh, golly me. Uh, Samaros, you're getting better. It's unseasonal. Oh, store spitting Camelida down. Hmm, Camelida down has got a storage pit. It's beautiful. Huh. Oh, you guys aren't recuperating very fast now, are you? 21. That's a lot. That's a big negative. Let's see. Let's uh, put them over there. So that's pay minus 6. That helps. That helps a lot. Maybe I should just wait in front. I'm going to ambush. Just in case they come through. And then we can ambush with reinforcements. That's I think that's a good idea. Let's see. Local rat. Local rat. Local rat. You available to help me with Galia? Fantastic. There you go. Konichios, you're so busy helping me with freaking Galia all the time. You don't have the freaking gravitas just yet. Way too much local person foreign cultures. No, no, man, no. I'll take that because there's not much to choose from. Okay, right, if we this would be the perfect time to get an agent if we wanted one. I do want one, but if we had to get one now. Okay, so no ships come down of the Avernie, so they could still be up here. Okay, I'm just doing a quick search. Uh, that's very good. Um, because uh, then I can't find you. I can't find the Avernis, um fleet. That's one thing. I could attack. I could attack. I could. If I really wanted to, I could attack. But I'm like... I'm so freaking stretched. I don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk losing everything and being booted off again. Yes! I finally got Trevor. Let's friend, do trade. Be welcome. I cannot settle on such terms. Your people are worthy, but my people deserve better of our talk. You 
I will never forget this. We waited so long to make this deal. And you go and I, I'll not forget this. Oh, you scumbag. To me that I must reject your no, no, you, your foolishness whispers to you. Get out of here. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm very disappointed. It took us a long time to arrange contact between our two people. And now you're like, nah, I don't care. So, it's a big blow. I'll definitely not consider you as as important as I used to, that's for sure. Okay, okay, so that's going on. Okay, so let's go to the next turn and see what we what we get. As soon as I can get this freaking army to recuperate, I might actually go up to Nemento Sena. Because I don't have as many reservations about attacking Trevororum. Depending on the Romans. All depending on the Romans. Although the Nervi aren't as strong as the Averni, so we, we have a decent chance. Let's roll. Okay. Oh man, you're back. Whew. What? That's it? Okay. Finally, we're having some peace. Let's see. How you doing? Oh goodness, we still haven't gotten the... How's the population doing? Okay, we're 14%. But the change per turn is slowing down, so that's not a good sign. It's not good. It's not good for the crew. Um, the Averni really have me puzzled because I do not know where their, you know, center of power is. I honestly have no idea and we could lose these towns so fast if we're not careful. Like, look, that garrison's barely rebuilt itself. 92 out of 600, so even if I wanted to take Namitosin, I just can't right now. Let's see again because this My is ridiculous. Friend, be well. Why are you rejecting I can't it? On such terms. Your people are worthy, but my people deserve better of our talk. There's something wrong with them. They've waited for so long we've waited to make contact with them to trade. And then they're like, ah no. What's wrong with you? Why would you do that? Let's see if I whoosh, give a little tap. Ten, ten wait a minute, minus seven. Zero. That's, I mean, that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. That's almost uh, enough to bankroll a whole new army. I mean, let's look at that. 206. So that's 800. 1,200. 1,600. That's peanuts. 1,725 plus... That's about 3,3. Three. Yeah, so I could bankroll out another army at that tax rate. Like if we can do it. If we can honestly do it. We're gonna be losing Wowly anyway, so might as well. I think I'll I'll do it. I'll keep the tax rate. Yeah, we're losing some central later, but we're getting way more bothers than that, so it's not too bad. It's a plus overall, except for these guys. What's wrong with this? Oh okay, for some reason, guys. You well, let's hope it balances out. Let's hope. Why is everybody fleeing to? For some reason, the capital. Dang, maybe I should. Uh, we're losing them everywhere. <sighs> but tax too much, I'm not going to be able to sustain it. Okay, maybe that's too soon. Maybe that's too soon. Let's just give a little bit more time for consolidation. But man, the cash flow. Cash flow is not going to be happy with that. If I, I mean, I can. Let's freaking, let's see. Can What can you make? I can make virtually any army we want over here. With the exception of our, I almost forgot, the exception of our freaking um, Lithobolos. Dang. Maybe I should make an army here in Kamala Danaun and put the Lithobolos in there. <sighs> Although it'll cost me a pretty penny to do that. Let's send you around. Let's send you around because the Lusitani came up here, which makes me concerned that they've lost their last settlements. Okay, because they're starving. These guys are just sitting peacefully. We might need to fight them and take the last of the settlement. I like Osus me, we're pretty chill with you, and if I attack the Osus me, then we're gonna lose a lot. Not just money, but, but prestige in the eyes of the people. The, oh, that's the Iceni. Who are they at war with? 
No man, also me. Also, also me. Oh, also me is chill with everybody. Aye, okay. I wonder. I'm considering dismantling the fleet, but I I need the fleet. I'm just gonna have to find a way to afford another army. Let's see. Who who do we have in the army that we can use? In the family. The armies are definitely family affairs because we can't sacrifice our people. That's the king. I don't want to sacrifice the king. There you go. Oh, you're already a general. His family is loyal. Well, they just happen to have the same name. Okay, I need to be very careful. So, Aseni Chieftain Kanichios. That's what I want. Aseni Chieftain. Because that name is... There you see. That's the other one. There we go, I see any chieftains. Let's see, uh, Mr. Doom. Yes, army. Take a slow goes. Now you can get two Lithobolos. Pretty penny. And we're going to recruit an agent for you. This man, he's painted his face, it's beautiful. His hair has got nice frosted tips or whatever. Okay. So there we go with that. Now, that's our second army. Cash flow hasn't suffered yet, but as soon as they come over, I'll come over and then we'll start building their units. No, what I meant is this. Because I'm going to build... We're probably going to be building on the lower end with the sensor and the botas. So we're going to have to build with these guys. They're going to be our botha army. Because we can't build them out of air. Air is too expensive. That sounds so weird. But okay, okay, next turn. Uh, seriously. Just brought them back. And they're like, hey, we have experience. Oh, I left it blank because I want them to reach a new level. Okay, no, no worries. Okay, let's go. No. Oh. oh, no. Oh no! <gasps> oh! Did this even count as an ambush? This didn't even count as an ambush. I'm gonna retreat, but I know it's a lost cause. This. How did they dismantle my ambush? I have no idea how this even happened. How did it not count as an ambush? I, I'm gonna have to say auto resolve, but wow, they blind. But uh, middle finger, middle finger, middle finger given, not received, freaking given, because I did an ambush. How the heck did you just say no, no ambush? That's bull. So once again, middle finger. This game is very good at giving middle fingers. Hey, wait, where's my... Oh, did, was he in range? I thought it was out of range. Oh my goodness, I thought my dude had retreated out of range. He was so far away. Oh, I can't stand this thing. This is such a middle finger. At first they just say, oh, you don't have an ambush. And then this, I can't stand this thing. This is nothing like the vanilla. Dang, is this thing bad. It's so hard. It's not the, it's not the fight, it's the tactical map crap. It just will not stop with the tactical map crap. That... Mm. I thought they had retreated. They were practically at the forest. How were they still a part of that battle? This is such a middle finger. Yeah, wh what the heck? How? He was a very good commander. How did he fail? This, I'm, oh man, do I hate this. And by the way, sure leave. I don't care. Like, 
Oh, I can't. I struggle to find the words for just how much of a middle finger this game gives you. Not just this freaking mod. I don't know why it is this way. It's hard. It's hard to freaking just. At least it's not it's not just a feature of the legendary. It is a feature right freaking through, but it's so unpleasant. Well, we can't go with the Urargi. Urargi are just not gonna cut it for this. Armor 17. These guys at least have an armor 38. We're gonna have to shovel out the big bucks. We're just gonna have to. I don't know how we're going to do that because we're probably going to lose Yolio Bona real soon. They had three whole armies in such a small area. How are they affording this? Look at the, the quality level. How on earth are they affording this? This is complete madness. Let's just, let's just see what happens. I'm really getting tired of this. I've just... It is so frustrating. It doesn't even look like it's difficulty level dependent. It's just non-stop. Uh, let's do this. Okay. So oh, oh, because we lost this game. So basic. This doesn't happen to the enemy, does it? We basically got a rebellion for losing the city. Like, this doesn't happen to the enemy. This doesn't happen to the freaking NP, the AI player. This is, I really don't like this. There's such an enormous disparity between what game mechanics are applied to you and to the freaking computer. It's really, it's unbearable. Okay, well, let's start. This is, this is going to be my first professional soldier army. So even though, yes, I still have the mercenaries here, which at some point I'll do away with them completely. Uh, but then I don't really know what I'll put my general as. I like to have my general in the same unit with a, a group. But really... It's, and the enemy of Ernie Fleet finally showed up. So, wherever they were hiding, they managed to come back quite fast. What a trap to spring. What a... Just colossal amount of strength they had in reserve. Where were they? They just came out of nowhere. I mean, there's three there. I don't know where the rest of them are. But they just came out and sprang it. Like, is this population at least holding? How's the population going? Okay, so we're still... We just need to keep our teeth into the freaking... <laughs> In this, it's, it's gonna get hard, but you just have to. Uh, dang. Maybe I should lift my taxes. Because we're gonna need to afford another army. And we're down to one, so why is it this expensive to add just one more army? Either way, either way, let's see. Do you at least have a full garrison? Thank goodness. Hopefully, something can come of that. Let's roll! Okay, thankfully they didn't attack. So something's holding them back. But that fleet could easily undo my army. <sighs> the, we're gonna need to get reinforcements there fast. So I'm gonna probably have to go over. Can I build the Albio Cludos? I think I can. Because I've got the. Yes, I still have these guys just don't have the barracks. I think I'm gonna have to. I don't want to lose the Olio Bona as well. Then it's all just been for now. It just keeps... We can get no fruit out of this venture if it just keeps going like this. Okay, so I'll try and sail over and defend the city. Hopefully we'll be able to get there in time. Let's see. Like, well, well, let, let's see. Is my... Getting nothing back. You? Okay, yes. Measure range with Brickia. What's up, Brickia? You are a beautiful wife, and you distract me so much. I lose campaign map movement range, but more children. So it's it's a good thing. You married a gifted husband, eh? 
<laughs> okay, that's good stuff. That's a good couple. Uh, let's see. Couple, public order. Nah, I'm not doing that. Ooh, let's do that one. Like that. Oh, I thought she'd honestly have more. Let's do this because we're not going to use that for any of our serious uh, generals in any time soon. So, might as well get the authority bonus. Okay, well, there's nothing else we can do then. Except hope for peace. You guys, I know, but small chance. And you, I hope you enjoy that. You threw... What? Do I still have contact with him? Greetings, friend. Oh, and now it's low. Just, I can't stand them. Let's just leave them alone. Let's leave them alone. Oh, there we go. Couldn't get there fast enough. Let's see. Close defeat. Let's see if I can make a victory out of this. We have to try. Like, it's, it's just a sacrifice all the way. Garrison fleet, garrison army. Okay, but I, I couldn't get my army there. Unfortunately, I wish I could. Just couldn't go fast enough because, once again, they just won't let it work for us. Ah. Okay, so, oh, they've got two. Dang! I hope we had a big chance if they had just one. And we've got allies too. Oh, which means my ability to flank them with my fleet's not going to be as good. Goodness, my game, what's with the middle fingers? It's ne I never get a fair chance, man, or at least a decent chance. It's just this constant bull that I have to put up with. This is so salty. This is the... I don't think I've ever been this salty with a game. I get so salty with this thing. That's very annoying because it's so different to the original. And I'm, I'm struggling to keep saying in a good way because the level of game mechanic deviation between you and the AI is just too much. It's too much to bear. There's too much penalizing you that doesn't penalize them. It's really upsetting. Why is this thing loading forever? It's at 95%. I'm, just, I'm struggling to keep my cool with this game. It is really getting annoying. I, I don't know how much more I can keep taking of this. You have our spears. Yes, but what does that count? What does that matter? You're not going to be able to do anything. And these garrison spearmen, they're going to be so weak. They're going to fold like paper. I mean, they lose. They lose ranked. I can't even get into a tight formation. Man, it's it's hard to stay motivated. It's really hard to stay motivated. This I'll just ankle this whole freaking campaign and just say I. Oh, because I'm really getting tired of this. Five. Oh, so 22. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, eight. So we don't know where the allies are. That's what frustrates me. If there weren't allies, this would have been much better because then we'd know they're all concentrated in the center. Now I have to get this split going because I want to make a pincer movement. I don't know which flank is going to be open, so I need to have half my force ready for anything. Okay, let's get going. Wait a minute. Enemy reinforcements approaching. We know. That was the problem. Okay, so oh So these are what's left. I say they're approaching, but oh, from that side. Hmm. Ready for battle, slingers. Spearman. Makes me wonder if I should be bringing my fleet out on this side, but they could probably just wait over here. These guys are going to be in for a challenge. Ready 
Oh goodness, they could be too late. I know what? You'll save in the time that it'll take to get there. Uh, full speed where you can. Okay, so that's starting. Like, look at them. They're still just these bare soldiers. Why are my freaking villagers not getting better? Why are they still barely better than peasants while the enemies were basically freaking foot soldiers? I'm tired of this. I'm tired of this nonsense. Just want some fairness, man. That's all. We just want some fairness. Okay, run, run, run. You two are very slow. Very, very slow. What are you doing? What is this? this? Get going. Hitler, oh goodness, this is just drunk at the helm. Okay. Let's take a look. You getting them? You getting them? Oh. Get in there, we can see goal. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Please use it productively. Come, we are not able to stand off more time. We can't get order. We just need to get them over there. Stop jamming up the freaking harbor with this nonsense. Seriously. Dude, no you're not. You're just incompetently floating about. You guys don't know what to do. There's two of them left and they're still holding out hope. It's ridiculous. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Number three. Yeah, number three, come over here. Not gonna last much longer. Run. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Just run. Control seven. If anybody can join up, that's good for them. But right now we are not in a position where we can do anything really different. Line up there. Where's number seven? Number seven, number seven, number seven. Come, come, come. Don't stand around there. Come, 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 come. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Have they discovered ours? Oh! The heck? Get them, what the heck are they thinking? Phalanxes are kicking in. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. These are not weak units. These are like light units. Okay, where's number seven? Come on. Come on, don't hold back. Get moving, get moving. Go, 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 go. Seriously, go. Just run. You serious? Drunk at the freaking helm. Leave him alone. What the 
freak? What are you doing? Nah, land there. Okay. Okay, so number seven's almost there. Go, 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 go. Three, go, 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 go. What's going on here? What are you doing? These guys still haven't given up. You're supposed to be these Moribotros types that are so strong. How on earth are you so weak against any freaking infantry? Go on. What the heck are you doing? Up there! What the heck are you doing? Up they're all coming. Okay, they're still all moving. The men are wavering. And this is how I lost my foothold in France a second time. Look, we we can't fight them. We'll kill them all. It is it's getting quite depressing. Okay. Charge in. Just get in there. Because the men are wavering. We need some area that we got another flank on them. I'm not having that little platoon stop me from freaking getting to them. Go, go, go. What are you doing? Go. Huh? You guys coming? Come on, get in there. And they just these those pike units of them just push through. I can't blame them, they just overwhelm us with numbers. Push your way through. We need to create a flank. Our front line's crushing, so we need to create a flank. This is a shameful display. <sighs> Sword followers! Warriors 
Not much of a front line left. Yeah, I'm not getting into contact with them. Look at this. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. These garrison soldiers, my freaking fleet soldiers. Men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Ah, 
Okay, I'm gonna fast forward this. This just combined with <laughs> the machine lagging. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. <sighs> I didn't even see the commander unit. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Our general is under attack. Yep, he should have been a long time ago. He should have been participating in battle earlier. <sighs> I can't believe it. I can't believe we pushed off the mainland again. Ay, 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 this is really getting. I don't know how to find the patience for this anymore. I'm honestly at a, my wit's end. Wait, what's that? I thought that's what I was selecting. Who are you? Oh, that just... Heavy melee infantry, but then why are you not effective? One of our units has used all its ammunition. All number six now. I don't think that's going to give them the inspiration. Men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Uh, 
I'm gonna have to honestly say I do not know what to, to do about this campaign anymore. I, I don't know what I'm misunderstanding about the... Like, how did they get their garrisons to improve? When I attacked the Oleobona, they had these Gal Gallic warriors that were not the original types. They were strong. They even looked different. Why are mine still so weak? I, s I thought I had reforms, but I'm still getting these super weak soldiers in my garrison. Is it something to do with settlement level? I wonder if I improve my settlement level if the soldiers would improve because I'm at my wits end with this. It just doesn't seem to be any way to do this, to, to make this better. Or to, to get you to actually stand against the enemy, like everything works against you. A tactical map movement, the freaking morale system, the money system, the city system, the garrison system. Just everything. Okay, this has been real bad. Like by the time I even get an army to do this again, if I were to, I'd probably lose all British British culture in this map, in this region anyway. So it's... What? Oh yeah. Well, there's no way. The worst is I turn a close defeat into a decisive one. Just look at this thing. Look at these guys, and they're so high skill. Okay, and their fleet came in range, but it's, I, I, I think I'll be able to get my army back on land. <sighs> but this has been an absolute disaster yet again. Yep. Ah, oh, we lost a lot of people. What do you mean tribute cancelled? Oh, I can't because I've only got two. Okay, well, you get back on land. That's the first thing. Go to Camilla de Noun. I know, just keep that. Look, that didn't help too much last time. You barely survived that one. But now we are absolutely saturated in money. The spearman, double swordsman. There you go. And some marginal cavalry. Marginal. There we go, I'm currently dealing with this. First time in a long time that I've had to actually upgrade my Warlord. Paragon, because it gives me that. Mainly focus the this. First time I'm going to actually have to look at ambush as a serious thing. All actions. Missile attack range. Ah, there you go. I'm gonna have to actually look at that with seriousness because I never saw ambush get thwarted that easily. That really messed up everything. So we're gonna actually have to build into that and get us, you know, resisting, freaking resisting the the people break my ambushes up. Okay. At least we're making a lot of cash, but that's going to be eaten up by this army's upkeep real fast. And I'm at risk of losing the channel. So I'm going to have to rebuild this immediately. Um, Argenios. Let's make you our new, f new fleet commander. Argenios, yes. Reinstate legacy. Seekers of Lioness, once again. Yeah, but... Ah, uh, Moribotros. 
Upkeep is heavy. But we needed them because... Exactly, nothing else would do. Nothing else was enough to shatter these fleets of the enemy. But okay, so... This this really is getting bad. Um, let me see. I, don't, I honestly do not know what it is with this mod. Why it is this hard. At even the lower difficulty. Freaking... Then at least then legendary. I don't remember legendary being anywhere near this difficult in the vanilla. <sighs> what really bugs me is I don't understand how to get my soldiers better, the ones that garrison my cities. Cause they did. When I attacked the Oleobona last time, they had very good garrison soldiers. I don't get why I can't get mine to improve. I don't see anything in reform here, so I don't. I honestly have no idea. It's got to be some mechanic that I'm missing, because it just doesn't make sense to me why it's this difficult. Costs money. Give some free. Oh, minus. Oh, plus five tax. Minus ten cost and upkeep. Goodness, it's a lot. Oh, plus five. Oh, that's terrible. I should be looking at Tribal Confederation. Oh, minus ten. Oh, man. Okay, okay. Well, I'll we'll, we'll work on that and get there. I'll just save. So, I guess that's it for now. Sorry about that. I just can't. Like, otherwise, I just need to look at... But the thing is, I need to make peace with the... Uh, Averni somehow, and then I can look at taking on some other area. But beyond that, I can't. I can't get shifted. I can't get moving because it was little blip pushed back. Uh, you know, better incursion pushed back again by just three freaking armies that sprang out of nowhere. How are they affording that amount of soldiers? I can barely afford to upkeep on a fleet and an army. And then there's their garrisons. When I attacked this thing, the garrisons were freaking strong. These Gallic warriors, look at that. Those Gallic warriors don't, they just took it and it's already one quarter reinforced back. And those Gallic warriors aren't weaklings. They're actual freaking proper soldiers. When I fought them on, in battle, my freaking cavalry ran away from them. And my cavalry is supposed to be top tier. So something is, it's just so inconceivably difficult to get something working. I'm really losing OP. I'm freaking considering scaling down to normal. This is just getting so hard. But thank you very much, everybody. This has been Edward of Child with the Iceni Hard to Video Impera Mod <laughs> Rome to Total War campaign. It's just going so badly. It's two, two attacks that they've batted off. It's really looking hopeless. I don't know how to achieve anything in this, this mod because this. It's, it's just insurmountable. It's not the stuff you do, it's the stuff that's supposed to be in place around you that just doesn't work. Ah. <sighs> Real tough. We'll see you in the next episode. It's an editor tide. Bye bye.